Hello everybody and welcome playing Fishing Planet Grinding out levels In the last episode I did level 8 through 14 at Rocky Lake And I uh, went for some Rainbow Trout, Common and Trophy But the more I level up the more experience I need so the rainbow trout is not as good anymore at level 14 falcon lake um, opens up it's unlocked and there is a great fish that I can go after and it's this thing over here this this fish is it's most probably the best at level 14 uh, with the fish uh, with the, all the gear available that you can buy at level 14 this is this is the best thing you can you can catch it gets um, gives you very good experience and some good money too and the best part is I can catch it at night time so I'm gonna do the same thing like I did for the rainbow trout I'm gonna fish only in the peak hours at night and that should do it the other thing is i'm not gonna change anything in uh, my equipment i'm gonna travel light the same thing uh, a stringer 10 kilograms that should be enough i don't need more and these are the two feeder rods i'm gonna use creek pro 240 with callisto 1400 i have mono 0.2 millimeters 1.8 kilogram test with 1.85 kilogram test leader on this one I have one octopus on the other one I may actually put um, different size alright for the Oregon red band I wanna go over here and I'm gonna go to the spot where I can catch uniques with better gear but for now I'm gonna uh, stick with commons and some trophies and I'm gonna walk up that little hill and go to the very far left of the map there is no there is no more that's it that's it I'm gonna set down my um, rod stand and I wanna face this way I wanna cast it over here that's about let's see what it's how far this is that's about 50 meters out I'm gonna clip this reel it out what was that oh man look at this let me see can I get this out well this definitely goes on YouTube I don't know what to call this guys there was a fish and a bite that was funny Oh. and I yeah I don't know what that is honestly well that's an interesting start I'll leave it And it's a waiting game now. Alright, first fish is on.
Now look, a normal one is giving me over a hundred experience compared to the uh, rainbow trout, which was around 60 to 70 on a, and this is a small guy and makes them very easy to reel out. So here you go, 124 cash and I keep going. All right, first night and my stringer is to the max, 10 kilograms. I got 12 fish, one is a smallmouth bass and one is a trophic cutthroat. The rest is all Oregon red band and I also got some trophies which are fantastic. I mean if you look at the trophies, the, the smaller trophy here is almost 200 experience. The big one here is like 250 and the money is still good so at level 14 with uh, gear you can buy at level 14 this is most probably the best fish to catch now there is a downside to all this because my stringer is small I don't make that much money although this is 2000 stink another day will cost me another thousand that's only a thousand left and then consider the uh, price for small minnows which is a little bit over 300 I'm not making that much money honestly it's I'm making about 700 a night which is not that much but I'm gonna level up as fast as possible and that's my goal here it's not about the money I want to level up as fast as possible um, that's it from the first night um, see you at the end well, I'm done and with the fishing in this map. It's been eight nights fishing here for uh, red band trout. I'm pretty happy with it. As you can tell, this is most probably right now the best fish I can catch with the best XP. You see the trophies are giving me pretty good experience. Again, guys, use barbless hooks. These here, instead of 250 to 40 ish, would be 200 XP if I was to use normal hooks. The other thing I did because I have two rods, I used one with size one octopus and the other one with two octopus. It does feel like the, the bigger one uh, gets me more trophies, but it also gets me less fish. So it's a good idea to have both, or um, otherwise. I may not catch enough fish anyway the exciting part here is that I reached level 20 it didn't take that long a little bit over maybe less than two hours a night in-game hours is what it takes to fill up the stringer and uh, get some good experience the other thing is at level 20 I already know that I unlocked the shiners and this is great news because I'm gonna use the shiners and some better um, line and rods and reels and all that to start targeting some unique fish um, from here on I'm not entirely sure what I'm gonna do but uh, it's quite possible I come back here for some uniques to speed up the uh, leveling until I get enough money and experience and maybe from here I go to uh, White Moose Lake we'll see what happens stay tuned guys I'm Balkan cheers and take care